New tonight, hit and left on the side of the road. Right now, the hunt is on for the driver who hit a man out for a morning run and never stopped. Good evening and thank you for joining us. I'm Wendy Ryan. And I'm Jamison Euler. ABC Action News reporter Ryan Smith is in Lithia with that family's plea for justice. It was a lot worse a week ago, that's for sure. His road rash is healing, yeah. but one week later. The concussion has by far been the worst and most lasting part of the whole thing. Jeremy Sperlin still feels the pain from that Monday morning jog. I've just been kind of out of it, haven't been sleeping well. I have a constant headache for over a week now. Sperlin says he was on a run, headed home along Dorman Road in the Fishhawk Ranch neighborhood. Car hopped the curb behind me, hit me from behind. I rolled back onto the hood, smacked my head pretty good. He suffered a concussion and somehow made it home. Medics soon took him to the hospital. It was really immediately after he left that I just started breaking down, crying. Um, it's still kind of emotional, sorry. Sperlin remembers very little about that morning. He says it was still dark out and jarred from the collision. He only recalls seeing a dark sedan drive away. Hillsborough County deputies did respond that morning and interviewed him about what happened. Honestly, it could have been so much worse. I could have lost my husband that day. Neighbors have submitted surveillance video in hopes it holds some potential clues. For now, Sperlin is thankful he's recovering at home with family. I forgive him, but I hope that they can develop the courage needed to do what's right next time. In Hillsborough County, Ryan Smith, ABC Action News.